Alright boys, we are back just in time it looks like to start up match number two, Strafe versus B BWS. Obviously, <laughs> with a huge two-piece out of Tony and Tempest able to make the 70 plus point comeback, it's it's incredible. It's ridiculous. Well, guys, let's get it started off with Tempest. Obviously, you know, able to get those last couple of seconds, the last four seconds that they needed and the last two kills that they needed. You are going to see a more standard B play coming out of the side of Strafe. Uh, you do see a sniper. Who's got the sniper? It does look like Danny. No, it's none of them. That's going to be Hesh with the two-piece, though. Unfortunately, we're going to have to get on board with that. Could it possibly be a three-piece? Nope, as he does see the re-peak, and he's going to get gunned down by the K-Bar. Tony putting up shots. That's now going to be Tony with a two-piece of his own, now getting to work. What he has to do here is clutch a potential huge round. Nope, not able to do it so close, but that is Strafe able to go up 1-0 over Strafe. And Crusher, search and destroy. I mean, this is going to be insane. Oh my god, this is insane. So I do want to go on board, obviously, with uh, Hesh, as he had a, a really, really, really nice two-piece, obviously, in the beginning of that round. I do see an Oh, I see an Oni. Whenever there's Oni, it, it, you're instantly one of my favorites, all right? See what he does opt to do here. He is going to be watching the wall run, as he's going to be able to pick up one. Not able to pick up the second, as that's Vayne there with the Ripper. Should be able to get another one, but no, he's not. Putting shots down, that is a flank now, but almost able to snap armor band, and that's not going to be three down, as it's a 1v1. Who's going to win it? And it looks like Strafe is going to do it. Accuracy able to get the best of it. Looks like Tony. Is that Tony? Who did he kill here? Nah, Rabanon. He was able to get the best of Rabanon, and this 1v1, you see the disrespect. I don't know exactly how VWS is going to feel about that one, but that's just disrespect coming out of accuracy right there. Although he's 3-0, you know, currently going off. See what they ought to do. A more traditional B play, obviously. Every fucking round I see a B play, alright, dude? Getting sick and tired of this shit. See what accuracy does ought to do. He does the wall run. Playing that corner is just a death trap. Oh, there it is. He saw the grenade. He pushes out. He's able to get one. Almost able to get the second one. But that's three down for the side of Strafe. And that's VWS with an extremely quick round. Oh, my Lord. See, that's the kind of place you got to have out of VWS, man. Y you, you let them do it. They're going to do it. You see Tony currently five and two as there was three down for the side of Strafe just in, an, in a, matter, a matter of a couple of seconds. So I do want to now go on board with Tony as he is 5-2 right now. He's currently going off as another traditional B play. I want to see what players number 1 and 2, Accuracy and Danny, ought to do, whether they go through the spawn or if they rat back with their teammates. It does look like we're going to have a traditional flank, you know, the usual. It's, oh my god. That is now going to be two down for the side of BWS. That's going to be three down for the side of BWS as Danny. Oh, my Lord. Strafe goes up 3-1 over BWS and the Crusher search and destroy after putting down some amazing shots from Danny with the ERAD. Van obviously uses the Ripper a lot, I know, because I've scrimmed him and stuff before, but BWS can still do it. It's just going to have to be, you know, like now. Let's go on board with somebody on VWS. Somebody maybe with not the nicest start. Let's do Rabanon, you know, having a little bit of a slow start. I know if we watch him, he might, you know, get a really, really, really nice play. Obviously, you haven't seen A play at all, so I don't know why uh, Sanity and Tony opt to go there. You see just traditional B. Strafe's going to hit it. This could possibly be that round that they need in order to come back. What they do? As Tempest with one. That's Rabanon with one. Almost able to get the second one, but Hesh is there. That's three down. It is now going to be up to Hesh to do it all, but he's not able as he's met by three K-Bars. That was never happening. Mm. 
That was insane. Tempest went on a three kill streak. That round went from two to three, uh, two to five kills. Definitely plays you need to see out of him. Rabandon obviously able to get his second one. Um, you know, Sanity having a little bit of a weird start. Uh, I definitely think he can pick it up. You know, we haven't been giving him too much love. You know, a lot of Tempest and Tony. Um, so let's go on board with Sanity. I just want to see what he's doing. Uh, that might be wrong. Obviously, another traditional B play. Something big here. Is he going to up and push out? No, he is going to get killed by fall damage in the Scarab. He got a lot of information. That's accuracy with the two-piece Bane with one of his own, but it's now going to be all up to Tony to do it. He's able to get two of them. Oh, my God, but he does get pushed from behind. Straight able to go up four to two over VWS. This, it's getting crazy. It's... I don't even... That's really nice shots right there. Although we only had to hit him once. You know, he put in some nice shots, making sure that he's able to clean it up. And you see the disrespect coming out of the side of Strafe. So now I do want to see a A play. Thank you. Whoa, what was that? Oh. So as we are going to see, accuracy is pushing up middle. He puts down some shaky shots, but that is Tony able to get traded out by Hesh after Tony kills Danny, making it a 3v3. I want to go on board with Sanity. He's able to pick up one as soon as we go on board with Sanity. Let's see if he's going to be able to pick up another one. He is. Should be, but no! That's now Rabanon left in a 1v1. Hesh has his overdrive popped. See where Rabanon opts to go. He's sitting middle map. Hesh does look like he's going to be a little aggressive. Just sit there, Rabanon. Just sit there, man. Never mind. He does opt to run away. As you do see, he's going back on the catwalk. Rabanon is going to have to make a huge play right here. And it does look like Hesh just doesn't go down the stairs. He did see him. He saw him. He saw him. And it's going to be EWS. Who was that? Rabanon. Able to make the big plays, able to make huge plays in order to clutch up, making it only a 4-3, one-point lead from the side of Strafe. Could we have another potential comeback? Let's see what's going to happen. I got to go on board with Urbana making huge plays. Sanity, obviously, you know, finally able to get his second kill that round. That's really what he needed. As you can see, a lot of A play has been happening. Rabanon has been spotted. That's going to be him putting down three fire in the hall, but that's now going to be three down as it's Danny left in a 1v2. He's got the FTL, but he's not going to be able to do it. VWS able to tie it up. Four to four. It's getting wild every single round. Every single round. It's it's becoming wild. So now we are going to have to go, obviously, back on board with Sanity. You know, he's able to step it up a little bit, you know. I definitely want to continue to see if he's going to be able to do that. But now we obviously see a little bit more of a traditional B play. Obviously, one guy uh, that's accuracy able to win that gunfight. But he's not going to be pushing middle accuracy. Almost able to win that. But that is Sanity. Taking the better of that. I want to go on board with him. Obviously, there's. it's now a 2v3. Make it a 1v2 automatically for uh, Urbanon. I uh, kind of want to see how that goes. Obviously, the bomb's going to be going down over towards the side of B. BWS uh, Urbanon is obviously going to opt to flank, which is a, a bit of a different play in a scenario like this. A lot of players push through now, but Urbanon should be able to get the worst timing on this player. He's going to be able to gun him. He's not going to be able to do it. That is strafe up 5-4. BWS is now having to win a guaranteed round to make it go a 5-5, five, five, or the series should be tied up 1-1. One to one. I, got, I, I, gotta, I gotta go on board with... I gotta go on board with Tony, man. He's got that reactive armor. 
He's got out that K-Bar. It's a traditional fucking B play. One that I'm not a fan of, but they're wrapping back. We haven't seen this used in quite a while like this. Everybody's starting to opt up on the B, but that's Rabanum with one. I'm going to see what players three and four are opting to do. It does look like they all start rotating back towards spawn. More of an A play. Not too surprised by that. It does look like it's going to be a wrap. Uh, six, seven, and eight all really crowded around in their base, obviously playing underground, opting for the rat back, possibly. You know, you'll just have to wait and see, but the bomb is now going to start to be pushed up. That's Sanity. Up there, and he's able to get one really, really nice fucking kill, as he doesn't use it, but it's now a 1v2. is going to have to do something big. This could be the ace of all aces. I can't even yell. I can't even yell. Is he going to be able to do it? Oh my god, it's one v one Him versus Tony, but VWS... Tony is able to do it, making it a 5-5. I thought he was going to get the ace of all time right there to close it out, but he's just not able to do it. Going crazier and crazier and crazier. It's now a 5-5. I got to go on board with um, Tony, obviously, because he has that reactive armor. And my phone just dropped. Sorry, guys. Hold on. All right. I've got it. Uh, strafe one. Possibly they've got they've got the specialist to win the game. They've got that act. They've got that FTL jump and they've got that uh, reactive armor. So I got to go on board with Sanity. Obviously, he could FTL. Just to the wall run. As you see, the FTL comes out of use, but Sanity's able to pick him up. That's not going to be a 2v3. For Bannon, Sanity. Going to come down to one player. He opts on it. And that's going to be a 1v2. For Bannon is able to do it. One more. You see him. He's done it. For Bannon has done it. VWS takes it just barely. Rabanon goes absolutely huge. Kinetic, you need to put me on the store, bro. Put me on the store. Put me on the store. What? I'm at a loss for words. Every single time you put VWS against the wall, they continue to come back. It's it's ridiculous. I don't know how they do it. Every single time they've done it, and it's now going to be up to O.